Hello everyone, I'm Brandon with Lenovo, and I'm here today with the ThinkCenter M93P Tower Desktop. Today we're going to be replacing the front USB assembly. This process will take about 10 minutes and it should be easy enough for anyone to do. There are no tools required to do this. Before we continue, we need to make sure that we're protected against electrostatic discharge or ESD. Make sure to shut down your computer and disconnect all cables and accessories from the system. For further information, watch our Understanding Electrostatic Discharge video by clicking the link in the description. And now that we're ready, let's get started. To remove the front cover, we must first remove two thumb screws. Then, we're going to press down on the release button, slide the cover towards the rear of the system, and remove it. Then we're going to pull outward on the three retaining clips to release the bezel. And then we're going to swing the front bezel open like a door and remove it. Before removing the front USB assembly, we must first disconnect the cable from the system board. Now we're going to twist the cable clip to open it and remove the front USB assembly cable from the guide. Now we're going to press the blue release button and pull the assembly out of the front of the chassis. You want to make sure that you guide the cable from the back so it doesn't get caught on anything. So now that we have the front USB assembly out of the system, we're going to remove the bracket and set it aside for the new one. So here we have our replacement front USB assembly. Now we're going to attach the bracket. Now we're going to feed the cable through the hole in the chassis, pulling it through the other side, align the assembly with the bay, and push it in until it latches. So now we're going to place the cable into the guide and twist the clip to lock it. When connecting the cable to the system board, it's important that the pin set on the cable matches the pin set on the system board. When replacing the front bezel, we want to assure that the hinges on the bezel are aligned with the holes in the chassis. And then we're going to place the bezel on and close it like a door. Then we're going to press inward on the bezel to snap the three clips back into place. When replacing the front cover, we want to assure that the tabs on the cover align with the slots on the chassis. Then we're going to place the cover onto the chassis and slide it forward to the front of the system. Then we're going to replace two thumb screws. 